Anything, Professor Zhao, that you wanted to add? Well, I've been thinking, you know, that there, there are several things. It's, it's such a mess. Okay, first of all, Charney, I'm glad you can lay out some kind of things behind this mess. It's, I think it's, um, it's the coming together of many, many things. You know, first of all, when they use like a double reduction, uh, I mean, reducing students' schoolwork has been going on since 1950s in China. And it's very hard to do. You know, it's, uh, it's they try to reduce, it basically reduce school homework. You know, it's, uh, some new policy just came out a couple of days ago to say, okay, no testing, you know, no paper-based testing for first and second grade and all those kind of things. So this is a, um, an ultra uh, revolutionary move, try to try to reduce student homework. I'm not sure it works, you know, but, but you know, this has been tried probably like uh, at least a hundred policies related to this have happened, but then it has a significant impact on companies. You know, during this process, as Charlie was talking about, a lot of companies popped up. And I, I have to tell you, I don't like a lot of the companies. Most of the companies are there to get the case test better. You know, it's really adding a lot more pressure. It's, and a lot of the companies, honestly, are not doing genuine education. You might think they're adding burden, they're adding testing. So make the testing harder, make the money spend involved, all kind of parents involved. There, there's financial. I'm not sure. I don't know what the government, you know, uh, or what their intention is. But this is setting up a major revolution in China. It's not only talk about the companies, not ed tech. It is actually schools now have to open longer. They have to offer uh, tutoring sessions to take care of the kids. Teachers are being asked to do a lot more work. You know, this is it's a massive thing. But also, there's also ideological things. You know, uh, I think Jenny was right. It's like, uh, is English important? What English be taught? I think there may be some ideological shifting, you know, in the whole process. You know, who controls the child? That's another thing. Who is the owner of education? So I just want to lay out that this is a, a massive thing that we are still waiting to see what can happen and how long will this policies last? Remember, policies can be made; it can be undone. Okay, if they are made today, they could be undone tomorrow. We yeah. don't know. That's another thing. Actually, we are waiting to see. I just want this has a. Let's have a nice conversation about to say, what can we predict? What can we guess? What could happen? 